Oh, hey everybody, it's the next video. It's like I never left. We are in Nassau, the Bahamas. We're here. Check this out. It's beautiful. We got the Carnival Liberty chilling next to us, which, fun fact, I think that that was the first cruise ship we ever went on it was a Carnival Liberty. And then like a couple months later, we went on the Carnival Valor. And that was the last time we were on Carnival. And now it's been Royal Caribbean ever since, at least once a year. But I really don't know what we're doing today. There's a, a beach on the other side that we might walk to uh, called, I think, Jun Junkano Beach. We might do that. There's like a little secret hidden bar that we might walk to. I don't know, something. But right now, we're cleaning up the porch area because we got breakfast room service coming. I got eggs, sausage, bacon, pretty much everything. Uh, room service costs like a little bit, like $8. So we're gonna do that. We also didn't get room service yesterday. Like I said, we were going to. The buffet was good enough. But yeah, you'll see the uh, room service here in a second. Also, I don't know how true it is, but this old dilapidated house that's been here just dying for the past, I don't even know how long, um, this whole strip, I heard, is going to become like like a perfect day. Like they're gonna have like a whole setup, like they're building it. They got the plans ready to build it. So that'll be interesting to see, because I feel like that's what Nassau needs, is uh, more things that are cooler. Since we're getting room service, this table, like there's a lack of table space in your room and that little table is not gonna cut it for room service because we wanna sit out here and eat our breakfast in the nice bohemian air. This table right here that usually all you ladies do your makeup on comes out, you see it? Comes out and I'm gonna put it out there so that we have a nice, a nice table. So just in case you didn't know, this table does move and it moves pretty easy. So that's a good, that's a good table for, for food, for room service food. You know, if you were with a group of friends or something, and you all just got this thing, that'd be pretty cool. Just partying. If you guys are some cigarette smoking people, which no judgment, do what you want to do. But God damn, smoke in this normal smoking area. This is, uh, wasn't here yesterday. And it looks like ashes. Looks like somebody ashed a cigarette or a blunt or something. And you know what? You miss the ocean. Fools. Fools. That's how you get yourself charged money or kicked off the ship. Like one person already did. They got kicked off. All of our room service came finally. It took them like 40 minutes, but they told us it would take 45. So that's not bad, I guess. Oh gosh, let's set this up. That's the American breakfast right there. And we got our coffee. Little cups, little milk right there, or half and half. Um, I think this is like bread and toast. We'll set it up and I'll show you. Of course, we had to get the robes to eat outside, which is nice. Let's show you guys the setup here. This is the breakfast buffet. I don't know why we got so many eggs, but we just said, if I'm spending money, I'm gonna get what I need to get. But there's like four eggs there. There's four eggs there. There's the eggs there. Uh, blueberry pancakes, a bunch of bacon. Too many tomatoes. Um, I've got a Bloody Mary and a mimosa, which, if you have the drink package, I know a lot of people ask this in the Facebook drink package group, if you have the drink package, no mimosas and Bloody Marys do not come with the room service. You'd have to pay extra for it. So I just went down to the brass bock to get them, and it took me like two seconds, so yeah. And then, coffee, carafe, bagels, toast, all the stuff, a whole bunch of cool stuff, and then, the Bahamas. So it's gonna be a nice, a nice feast. We probably won't eat all this, unfortunately. Just gotta pour up some fresh coffee too. There's a lot of drinks. Ah, yes. While somebody's literally dying and coughing up a full lung, like underneath us, whatever, we're eating breakfast. You guys, the Disney wish just keeps following us, man. I think that might be a, uh, a sign, this might be a foreshadow, because earlier I told you on the other side of the ship is the Carnival Liberty, that was our first ship. That's, that's the past. We're on the anthem right now, that's the present. Maybe that's the future right there. Disney wish? You want me to spend an exorbitant, 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 exorbitant? How do you say that word? Exorb, exorb? 
You want me to spend a lot of money on a cruise ship? That's probably no better than this one. Sick. But I do want to do that. That looks like fun. They got that Disney horn sound, which is uh, less annoying than the normal horn sound. Hmm. You guys, I have not been vlogging today because uh, it's been a rough day in my brain. But we did get these. They're called Strawberry Blondes. I have no idea if they're good or not, but I'm going to let you know. They look good. Tropical. Yeah, we're tropical as hell. Caribbean. We're Caribbean up right now. I don't even know. These are called Hawaiian shirts. What's with Caribbeans? Yeah. What's the true Caribbean? Floral. Is it? Yeah. Maybe. According to that. Maybe. Now sip it and tell everybody the people what you think. Thank you, sir. Outstanding. <laughs> Strawberry blondes. 10 out of 10. It's good. It's minty. There's strawberryness. It's good. <laughs> Guys, I got talked into a Goombe smash. She's still working on this strawberry blonde because it's only been like four minutes and I killed mine off. And now it's Goombe smash time. Goombe smash That was good. That's top tier. Uh, saying goodbye to the Carnival Liberty. They're leaving out. It's also, again, the first ship we ever went on. Crazy. That was like eight years ago. Seven years ago, something like that. <laughs> and then look you guys, the goddamn Atlantis we can finally see. Look at that. Yeah. Isn't it wild hearing four dudes sing Sweet Home Alabama that have probably never been to the States ever? It's just like four Caribbean black dudes singing Sweet Home Alabama. It's pretty crazy. But they're doing a good job, it sounds really good. We haven't left yet though. But this does look good. Everything looks great. You can finally see Atlantis. It's beautiful. Look, I had the bros make me a, a Vegas bomb. We're doing Vegas bombs and it's not even dinner time yet. What the heck are we doing? She also got an ice cream cone. Oh, well, we're leaving. We're out here leaving. It looks nice out. It looks pretty good. It's cloudy as hell, but it's fine. We're having a good time. Ah, we're going to dinner in Wonderland, and it's Caribbean night, so we're obviously <laughs> real caribbean up. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, look at that fine shawty. We're here at Wonderland. Look at this. She got a giant chair, and I've got I a cool water <laughs> glass. All right, this is how you do it. You get it, this, uh, well, I can see it, but it's supposed to be blank, which is fine. She got a silver one. I've got this. We got a paintbrush. This magic water right here. There you go. Ooh. Ah, look at this. We're talking magic. This is your menu for Wonderland. And that's nice. Alice in Wonderland. Also for the drink menu, I got the smoke ring. It's whiskey with vermouth, maple syrup, Angostura bitters. So it's basically a uh, Manhattan. And then you got a what? On the back, Cheshire Cosmo. Oh yeah, Cosmo with the Grey Goose Vodka, Cointreau, fresh lime juice, cranberry juice, we're gonna get some cotton candy and some drinks. Yes. Drink package, that's what we're doing. It smells smoky as hell in here. It's, I like it. He just wants to get people. Look at this cool fork. Mm. It's all crazy looking. Ooh, nice. Cool. Oh, let it let it go. One, two, and three. Ooh. That's a smoky drink. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> For being honest, this drink is really nice. It's like a smoky Manhattan. I'm a fan of it. How's your uh, cotton candy martini? It's really good. Mm. It just tastes like a, it doesn't taste like cotton candy, so it's not super sweet. It's just like straight up vodka. Well, that's good. And this tastes like straight up bourbon mm. with smoke. So, our appetizers came out. This is uh, a lobster bisque uh, soup 
but it's in a spoon and it's interesting and it looks good. And then we got the mushroom, some kind of mushroom soup, but it's like a jelly thing that pops. It's gonna be strange. Then we got the little shrimp with the scotch bonnet, uh, scotch bonnet stuff. Then we got these cones. So the, I'm, I'm gonna sit here and say the appetizers are looking app appetizing. We got some good apps. Oh, cool. So smoky and so. <laughs> <laughs> so this the butnets, another one from Fire Element. The nets we make from katai pido, same like in the shrimp. Okay. And then we have hard boiled egg on top. The egg white is real, but the egg yolk is reconstructed. We make oh. from Japanese mayo, mustard, and Tabasco. Okay. On top we put fried tempura and sriracha sauce to make it more tasty. Oh, okay. Please cool. enjoy. All right. Thank you so much. All right. You're gonna try out this lobster. This lobster soup. Yeah. Look at that hot thing. Oh yeah. Here we go. It's lobster bisque soup in a spoon. It's magical. All right, we have a gigantic shrimp that I have to dip in the scotch bonnet stuff, which I'm excited about. Ooh, scotch bonnet like fluff. <laughs> what the heck? This is what I've been missing is some spicy. That's so good. I'm gonna have to give this one a go. 10 out of 10. Of course. <laughs> now all we have left is this reconstructed, deconstructed egg thing. Which sounds pretty cool. Here's the soup. We've never had a soup here. I've never, no. This looks awesome. Yeah. Great. Right. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you. All right, next thing we got, you guys. This is a, this is a, a deconstructed, reconstructed construction of uh, a caprese or a capri salad. Oh my god! You got a lot of, a lot of flash over there. This right here is not a real tomato. It's a reconstructed one made out of a bunch of stuff. And then you got these olives right there. That one and that one. Those aren't real olives. Then this. This is actually blue cheese mixed with uh, olives that they dehydrated. And then that is like some kind of coulis. I don't know, it's crazy. I'm gonna try it out. We gotta, I gotta cut her up. What the heck? What'd you get? White rabbit Rita, Patron tequila, Contro, blue curacao, fresh lime juice, and salt foam. Super good. That's what I, fi I figured by your face that it was super good. I'm still working on this thing because this is a light sipper, all right? This is this is straight liquor, pretty much. This is tuna tartare. That is a yuzu ice thing. And then there's, if I do this, hold on, hold on. Oh, I'm messing it up, I'm messing it up. But there's, there's a spicy tuna in there. That's a, um, what do you call that? Parmesan crisp. So it's cold, spicy fish. By the way, this was fantastic. I don't even like fish. That was filled with spicy tuna. It tastes like uh, a spicy, spicy tuna roll in a lime. It was really good. The entrees came out, and this is a braised short rib. That is mashed potatoes. All this stuff around the edges, I don't know. I'm going to eat it, though, because it looks great. She got the same thing because she's trying to be me every chance she gets. And now we have pork belly. That's pork belly with like a peppercorn sauce. That's, I think he said, um, celery root, uh, pork skin, apple chips, kale. Interesting. We're gonna try it out, but first, I have to do this. It's super tender if you can't tell. Golly. Look at that. That's magical right there. Oh my gosh. You see how, how tender that is? I did. Ready? <laughs> do it. Yeah. cream inside there. <laughs> that is so freaking right, cool. I will explain from the world. 
bowl oh, yeah. is dark chocolate. We make like a bowl. Inside we have salted caramel ice cream and chocolate mousse. And this one here, mystical mushroom garden. Ah oh, yes. This the red thing is consists of pistachio and white chocolate, and we cover with the raspberry jelly. Oh. On top is marshmallow, okay. and then in the bottom we have meringue. Apple sir, forbidden mm. apple. Forbidden we apple. We make from three different mousse. Okay. We have raspberry mousse, blueberry mousse, and blackcurrant mousse. In the bottom of the apples we have coconut layer cake. Okay. And on the top there is lemon curd. All right, thank you so much. We got three desserts. You gotta, you know we gotta I was saying I couldn't even eat one dessert. That, you gotta cut that in half so we can see all the layers of your apple. That is true. Whoa. <laughs> Look at this apple. Uh oh. Oh, oh. Look. Oh my god, would you just look at it? Let's see this mushroom. Oh. Why can't I do this correctly? It looks like that when you crack it open. I know I failed at trying to cut it open with my uh, my spoon. It didn't work. That's like a coconut cake. It's like raspberry stuff. Raspberry. and But it looks like an apple. And it's so good. But if you don't like coconut, don't order that. We're getting full fancy. So we got espresso martinis. We had to. So go with the dessert. Also, I want to pass out and die because I'm so... God... I'm so full, I'm gonna die. All right, here we go. Let's see, now we're off to Spectre's Cabaret in 270, which we're here. We're There's here now. Line, everyone's waiting, we're, and uh, we, gotta we gotta do a thing. It. Reserve it up. It's looking good. Spectre's Cabaret is where we're going right now. You guys, 270 is probably the coolest lounge area on any ship. It's one of the coolest. This whole place is cool. Uh -huh. 